This is the Hustlers Corner. Guys, this is Buddha Buddha DJ Smooth straight out of Johannesburg in South Africa. You guys do know, I mean, I share about um, wisdom jewels, hustlers nuggets on how you can become better. Um, before I go on with this video, I'd like for you to sh like, share, subscribe. Let the world know about what we're doing. Okay, today it's book recommendations. What books am I recommending for you as a hustler who's out there putting on their grind, growing their businesses, growing your brand, growing yourself? Remember, you are your own brand as well, you yourself, right? So let's look at these books quickly. It's not a long video, very short video. The first book, of course, that I'm going to recommend is my book, The Art of Hustling. Guys, you have to check out this book. Look at the bottom on the description. There's a link that I've just put in there. Click on the link. Go straight to the audio book. You don't have to buy it. You don't even have to go buy the physical soft copy. I've already read it for you. So I've read it for you. Click on the link on the description. Go straight to the video. Listen to the audio book. What is the book about? The book talks about you dealing with your own mind, dealing with yourself first before you can deal with your external hustle. You have to get yourself right. You have to get this right. It speaks about the mind, speaks about the laws of nature. It doesn't go deep into the laws of nature. I'll be going more deeper into those details on my future books. On this book, I've dwelled on one law of nature, which is the law of attraction. But then I focus more on using my own hustle or my own journey as a case study. A lot of you guys do know I've done music, I've done radio, I've done TV, authoring books, giving talks, DJing, music, being on the mic. I'm a businessman, I'm an entrepreneur, I'm a philanthropist. I do all these different things. I share about them and I take my story or my journey as a case study to share on different, different principles on how you can become a better hustler. This book will help you know how to sell, know how to close, but you have to put the information you are reading on this book onto action or into action for you to see the results. The results is not going to help with you just memorizing the book. It's not going to work. You have to do the work. So the first book I'm recommending for you is The Art of Hustling, Seller Surrender by DJ Smooth. The second book I'm going to recommend is The Book of Proverb. The Book of Proverb is an amazing book. I've had a chance of interviewing him, taking on from this book. So he basically had an album called The Book of Proverb. And from the different songs that he had on the album, he's basically turned the entire album into a book. He breaks down the different chapters, or let me say the different songs, into chapters. And then he explains those chapters. If you haven't had a chance of listening to that interview, you've sat with him here on the Hustler's Corner, look at the link on the description, click on that link, it'll take you straight to that interview where he shares about his life story coming out of Kimberley, a small town. He had aspirations of becoming a successful musician. He achieved that goal, but he also has done um, graveyard radio. He's, he shares about his mother, his childhood upbringing, um, the loss of his mother, very sad story, may I so rest in peace. But he shares about his hustle and how he got to become the man that he is today. It is an incredible book. You will learn a thing or two from him. And also the co-author does an amazing job in putting this book together. So big up to Debo Hoteki Isho and Babalo Rampa. Both of you guys have done an incredible job on this book. That's the second book I'll recommend. The last two books I'm going to recommend, they are a must read. They are both must reads. The first one I'm going to start with is The Magic. If any of you guys have watched the movie The Secret, The Secret is by an author called Rhonda Byrne. Rhonda Byrne did The Secret. It's the same author from The Secret. So those who have not read The Secret, maybe you are younger, the new generation, The Secret talks about what I was talking about that is on my book, The Law of Attraction, just the laws of nature, how they operate and how they'll never change. And for you to beat the system or for you to understand how life operates, you need to read and understand the laws of nature. Basically, this book breaks it down for you and it talks about the magic that you possess yourself. Not the government, not the America, not anywhere. You yourself. You possess a certain magic that you're, you're probably not even aware of. And it, it helps you tap into that magic about yourself and become a better person. Let me read quickly at the back what does the synopsis say. It says, one word changes everything. For more than a century, words within a sacred text have mystified, confused, and been misunderstood by almost 
who or by almost all who read them. Only a few people, very few people through history have realized that the words are a riddle and that once you solve the riddle, once you uncover the mystery, the new world will appear before your eyes. In this book, The Magic, Rhonda Byrne reveals this life-changing knowledge to the world. Then on an incredible 28-day journey, she teaches you how to apply this knowledge in your everyday life. No matter who you are, no matter where you are, no matter what your current circumstances are, the magic is going to change your entire life, just like The Secret did. So I highly recommend this book. This book go get it. The last book I'm going to recommend, ah, oh, this is my favorite book. I, you see, I've read The Secret, I've read The Magic, I've read Think and Grow Rich, I've read, I've read John C. Maxwell's many books, How Successful People Think, and all those different books. A lot of them are all sharing the same concept. But how this book summarizes everything and breaks it down for you, and what I love about it is an easy read. You can literally finish this book in two hours. Very, very small. The book is called The Game of Life and How to Play It. It's by a lady called Florence Scovelchen. I encourage you to go read her earlier works as well. Go research about Florence Scovelchen. She was born in the late 1800s. She died in the, in the early 1900s. She is an incredible writer and an incredible author. She writes about what we call metaphysics is basically a concept that was taken from our ancestors and our forefathers here in Africa. And over the years, there's been other people who have been able to untangle the riddle that is this thing called life. Other people complicated, but once you start reading books like these, you'll understand that it's not that complicated after all, if you understand the rules and how the world operates. Let me quickly read through the synopsis at the back, but I highly recommend it. It says, the Empower Your Life series, the game of life and how to play it. Florence Scovishan says, they say here, informal, friendly, and humorous. This little book has inspired thousands since 1925 in its first publication. It is a practical, and it uses practical examples to show how positive attitudes make you a winner in life. Self-improvement expert Norman Vincent Peale endorsed it as an essential guide, helping readers to find prosperity, solve problems, and have better health. Written by an artist, teacher in an entertaining easy to read style this volume presents brief concise instructions the author floral uh, florence scovelshan draws up biblical examples to explain the timeless principles behind her recipe for success real life stories of her many clients illustrate how life can be transformed from a losing battle to a winning game ah what an incredible book. Guys, I highly recommend this book. Go check it out, The Game of Life and How to Play It by Florence Scovelshin. Go check out The Magic from the writer of The Secret, Rhonda Byrne. Go check out The Book of Proverb by Deborah. Proverb. Congratulations, brother. What an awesome, awesome book. And then go check out The Art of Hustling by myself, yours truly, DJ Smoo. Those are my book recommendations for today. I'd like to end the video by reminding you to like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to click the notification button on the Hustlers Corner. Don't forget to click the link below. Go check out the Proverbs interview or click the link below. Go check out the audio version of my book, The Art of Hustling, um, Sell or Surrender. Mahala. I'm not even charging you. I'm giving it to you because I love you guys. This is The Hustlers Corner.